He makes a great pass at the golf ball. It's powerful, but it's rhythmic at the same time. Well, par fours, they're not all the same, Rich, but after that tee shot, I guess you can say this one's going to be easy. That was a beauty right there. Well, Frank, as we know, golf is not played generally on a flat surface, and here we go, uphill. Yeah, and the uphill lie is going to guarantee you more loft than normal, so you're going to have to counteract that with uh, maybe an extra club. Frank, this one looks like it might have a postage stamp on it. Airmail City. Yeah, lick it. Send it. Not terrible, but not his best. Yeah, outside chance, really, for uh, for Birdie, but um, really, it was a, a rather poor approach shot. Well, that's not the way you wanted to start out the backside here. Yeah, you can't afford from uh, inside 10 feet. It just, you feel like you have to make those. And um, I mean, they really sting when they miss. You don't want to let this one get away. This is about concentration and focus at this point. No damage done, made the par. Now to the first par three here at the Tour Championship at East Lake. It is the second hole, 214 yards. And really to score well at Eastlake, players cannot afford to miss the green on the short side of the flagstick, and that's especially true right here. This par three plays a bit shorter than the yardage, but it is a must to put the ball on the green. That green slopes dramatically from back to front and from left to right, and is guarded by bunkers on both sides. Getting set for this next shot from the rough, what does the player need to be careful of here, Frank? Well, this is where we're going to see exactly how good they are because, you know, that's not exactly the best lie, but it's sort of doable if you, if you know what you're doing. Frank, not close, but from that lie, not bad. Oh, that's excellent. Seriously, given the conditions, Rich. Really? This is an awkward length. So that's a bogey and now to one over par for the tournament. We talked about the good mix of holes to start here at East Lake. So coming off that par three second hole, now to the very short par four third, just 390 yards. But really, with all of the bunkers and the trees and this green, it's a tricky proposition. Frank couldn't ask for anything more. Uh just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. Second shot. Good look at the green. Should be safely on deck. Just an incredible shot. That is a very makeable putt after a great approach. Well played.
Frank, you've navigated so many leaderboards in your career. This is the way to do it, isn't it? Well, there's plenty of holes ahead too, Rich. Third place, a really good position to be playing from here on in. We have already begun. Let's pick up with the action at hole number four. Early in the round, still holding steady, even par on the day. Yeah, it's got that feel it could go either way here. Next few holes will probably tell us which way. And now it's right in his wheelhouse, good position where he can attack the pin. Yeah, he has all those options now. With that ball sitting up, you can bring it in high, you can bring it in low. The choice is yours. Oh, nice strike, Rich. Not quite directly in line with the flag. Just drifting a bit to the right, but he'll settle. Beautiful shot. That is tight. Unbelievable. That is one to savor for the rest of the round. Frank, this would be a nice way to jumpstart the round. Yeah, his momentum uh, can quickly go in the right direction if he makes this. Knows. It is a four-round tournament, setting himself up for a good weekend, maybe a great one. The young star makes his birdie. Don't forget, second-round coverage coming your way tomorrow here on EA Sports for our entire crew. I'm Rich Lerner saying so long for now. NBC Golf Channel on EA Sports in association with the PGA Tour proudly presents the final event of the FedEx Cup playoffs. Today it's live second round coverage of the Tour Championship. Yeah. Oh, solid strike right in the heart of the green. Early part of this second nine with a good approach shot. Now, pretty good chance for birdie. Made a par in his previous round. This time, it's for birdie. There's an opportunity wasted. Just knocking him for a par, and let's forget about this one. Um, golf is not about perfect, but it's going to hurt the course. Got it for par. Another short par four here at the Tour Championship, East Lake Golf Club with a FedEx Cup on the line. The 12th is only 391 yards. What do you make of this hole, Frank? It's a nice little downhill par four, Rich, um, going all the way back down towards East Lake itself. And another positional hole off the tee, leaving just a short iron in. But uh, very deceptive green to read. It's actually fairly flat. Be a little disappointed with that because it lands in the rough and it appears to be fairly thick over there. the skill and that that was sublime just good hands coming out of the rough able to manage the distance and now in great position well, that was a good looking putt just not falling right now no, sadly he's going to be disappointed standing over this putt concentrating on the read has it
Continuing from the Tour Championship at East Lake in Atlanta, Georgia, all the drama of the finale for the FedEx Cup. And this is a chance to make birdie. We're at the downhill, par 4 12th. It's only 391 yards. A good, accurate tee shot gives a player a chance to make a three. Players bracing against these strong, gusty winds. Really a challenge out there. In the thick stuff. Thick? It's brutal out there. Has this from 170 yards away. East Lake Golf Club was named the permanent home of the Tour Championship by Coca-Cola back in 2005. It is the final event of the PGA Tour playoffs for the FedEx Cup with only the top 30 players on the points list qualifying each year. So the second of the par four goes begging, and now I'll have to rely on the short game. Yeah, but a short game, as we all know, can uh, redeem a lot of mistakes. Let's see if he does it here. Can't hide the flagstick from that man. He is just uh, unbelievable. That that never deviated offline. Not a gimme, but well within his range. I thought that was in. Yeah, it looked good. I mean, line, pace, it's hard to be critical of that. Been pretty good all day from this distance, just trying to take care of business. Well, too bad he gives one back. Straight away par four here at East Lake and the Tour Championship, the 14th, 442 yards. This is taken off on a weird line. And it's going to be in the rough, it looks like. Well, where this ball's going, there's no fairway there, only rough. Second shot coming out of the rough here. Seems to like it. Looks like it's headed for the green. Rich, that was some shot out of the rough. I really didn't think he could even get that on the green. Well, just to get it on the green, as you say, I think is a big win. Just when you think you're going to make birdie, now I have to really concentrate on this and at least make par. Right in the heart.
There are just two par fives here at the Tour Championship presented by Coca-Cola. This is the second and last of the five pars, the 15th. It is only 525 yards, and if you walk away with par here, you will likely have dropped a shot to the field. This is a chance to make birdie or eagle. Frank, they say you have to ride the wind. Well, he got all of that one. Got every ounce out of the conditions. Well, with a good shot here, Rich. Uh, this eagle on the cards, hole very reachable from where he is. Don't get many opportunities like this. This is a good place to take advantage. like that strike. Uh, that was top of the tree. Really not much to this. The only issue would be a lack of concentration or focus. just misses. My goodness, what does a guy have to do to make a putt out here? Even par, currently. Has the birdie to move to three under par for the championship. Frank, right where you want to be at the midway point of a tournament. Yeah, you know your game's solid. Um, the focus is more on the leader and that you can just go out and play. Uh, excellent position to be in.